CIET NCERT presents audiobook of mathematics for class 5 entitled Math Magic 5 This is the chapter 5 Part 1 Page 71 Does it look the same? Let's make patterns from a drop of color Below this we have the picture of a girl who is showing us two different patterns, pattern A and pattern B. She says to us, I have made these patterns from a drop of color. You can make them too. Make your pattern. Take a sheet of paper. Fold it into half. Open the fold and put a drop of color on the middle line. Fold it twice and press it to spread the color. Open it and see a beautiful pattern. We see this entire activity with the help of pictures. Can you cut this pattern in such a way that you get two similar mirror halves? In how many ways can you do it? Page 72 Look at this pattern. A boy is showing a pattern in a picture which has a dotted line running in the middle vertically. The dotted line divides the shape into two halves. But if you fold it along the dotted line, the left half does not cover the right half completely. So the two halves are not mirror halves. On the right side of the page we see the picture where the pattern has been folded along the dotted line and we can see that the two halves are not mirror halves because the left half is not covering the right half completely. Now look at another shape. If you fold it along the dotted line, one half will cover the other similar half completely. So the two here are mirror halves. Below this we have the picture of a boy who is holding a triangular pattern. A dotted line is running again through the middle of it vertically. This time when it is folded along the dotted line, in the picture to the right we see that yes, these are the two mirror halves because one half is covering the other similar half completely. Now imagine the same for these pictures. Below this we have the picture of a girl with a purse. The purse has a pattern drawn on it with a dotted line running in the middle vertically. The second picture is of a boy in some water body holding and playing with a star shape. Again, there's a dotted line running in the middle vertically. For the teacher. On the next page, children need to understand that even though the shape is symmetric, the color scheme of the figure can make it asymmetric. For example, in shapes 10 and 12. Encourage children to look for asymmetry based on the shape as well as the color scheme. Page 73 Here we have about 15 different figures drawn out. Each of the figures has a dotted line running in the middle of it. In some it is vertical, in some horizontal. Which shapes are divided into two mirror halves by the dotted line? Page 74 Mirror Games 1. Here is a picture of a dog. You can place a mirror on the dotted line. Then the part of the dog to the right of the line will be hidden behind the mirror. What you will see is like A. There is a picture drawn of the dog in a particular pattern and a dotted line running vertically. And if we place a mirror on the dotted line, what we see is shown in the figure A. Below this, there is a white square in which another figure is there. It has a dotted line running vertically 
as well as another dotted line running horizontally through it. Look at the figure in the white box. On which of the dotted lines will you keep the mirror so that you get shape B? Also tell which part of the picture will be hidden when we keep the mirror on the dotted line. There is a picture B which shows the picture of the figure in a different way. You have to guess how to get that picture by placing the mirror on one of the dotted lines. Page 75 Now make a line on the white box to show where you will keep the mirror to get the picture next to it. Below this we have pictures C, D, E and F. You are supposed to tell where the mirror should be kept every time to get the desired picture. Page 76 2. Venki has made a red and white shape. Make a line on the white box where you will keep a mirror to get that shape. Look at how the line is drawn in the first box to get the picture next to it. Below this we see the picture of Venki and his red and white shape in a box. The box is white box and you are supposed to tell where you will keep the mirror to get a desired particular shape. Part A, B, C, D and E have to be done in this way. For the teacher. Encourage children to look at the final picture in each pair and guess where the line of symmetry should be made on the original shape in the white box. Page 77 Half a turn Once there was a king. He was upset because thieves kept stealing costly jewels from his locker. Here is what the locker looked like. Below this we see the picture of a big locker and some thieves standing around it. The locker could be opened by giving its handle half a turn. Another half turn and the locker would be locked again. The king would often leave the locker open, thinking it was locked. Can you guess the reason? Below this we see the picture of the king looking a little puzzled, because on the left and right side of that picture we see the picture of the locker in open and locked positions. Page 78 one day his clever daughter gave him an idea which he liked very much. Now he never got confused. Can you guess what the idea was? The king's daughter asked the king to put a dot on one of the yellow blades. On the right side of the page we have the picture. The top picture shows the daughter giving the idea to the king which he seemingly likes. Below that is the idea being implemented. The dot on the yellow blades now indicates the position of the locker, either open or locked. The king had many such lockers with different handles. Check if, on giving them half a turn, he can get confused with these two. Below this we see the king with many more lockers and how he could do something with their different handles. What will you do to solve the problem for each of these? Same after half turn. Guess which of the shapes below would look the same after half a turn. There are seven different shapes shown below and you have to tell which of them would look exactly the same even after half a turn. For the teacher, the focus of the exercise following the story on the next page is to 1. Break the symmetry of the figures 2. Recreate the symmetry in the same figure Page 79 Do you find it difficult to tell? If yes, then there is a way to check your guess. Here's how you can do it. Take any of the shapes, 
trace its outline on a sheet of paper. Now keep the shape on its outline and give it a half turn. See if the shape fits its outline. Below this we see the picture of a girl doing the same exercise. She has taken a shape, she traced its outline on a sheet of paper and now she is keeping the shape on its outline and giving it half a turn. This way she will find out if the shape fits its outline. Part 1 Chapter 5 Ends Here Narrator Gaurav Marva Assistance in Production by Somya Malik Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary Presented by CIET NCERT New Delhi, India